How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to the next League of Legends video. We're playing some more Morgana support. And we're playing a Dark Harvest build. I messed up my screenshot here, so don't mind me. But we're doing Cheap Shot, Eyeball Collection, Treasure Hunter, Mana Flow, and Scorch. Uh, I wanted to try Dark Harvest. I've been thinking about it since yesterday. Um, I'm like, what fun build can I do? And which character can I make a fun build with? I'm thinking Morgana, Burn, Dark Harvest, Scorch? Um, we can just get enemies low, and what perfect character other than Draven to burn enemies up and get them low and execute. They've got a Neela and a Leona as their bot lane. So all we can do here is just keep harassing them. Keep using Scorch. Just throwing my uh, Q to get a little bit of um, an understanding as to what their movement patterns are. We actually got Leona's Flash on me and Draven just invading them. So we're just going to keep pushing them because they are a little bit afraid of us, it looks like. And Leona's putting herself in a position that could allow me to find her, but she did dodge my first one. That's fine. want to get the bind out on the Neela, get her low. We got Leona's uh, first potion out. We have mana flow to keep ourselves up uh, later on in the game. But we're already running out of mana. We're halfway through. We gotta be careful with how much mana we are using here. So this is a little different than my recent Morgana build where I've been running Jack of All Trades Glacial Augment. Um, we are not really going to be waiting for items. We're going to try and get early kills here. And hopefully just be an overwhelming presence. Let this Draven become a menace while we try and finish them off. Get Dark Harvest procs. My first Dark Harvest will come out here. Keep in mind that Leona's W does mitigate um, tech damage. So... We won't be able to, see, able to see that much damage on her, but at least we're keeping her suppressed. Looks like we did not get first blood. Jax drew it first, okay. Our Dark Harvest will be ready to pop again. Just try and burn them. Try and pop our next Dark Harvest. Uh, we could just easily do that with W here. Kane wants help over in the river, which we will go and help him. I think we can get a kill here. They are pretty weak. We got Flash. That That's something. Got Cannon Experience. Unfortunately, no Scuttle for Skarner, but Kane's doing fine in farm, right? I don't think we really care. I don't want to use any mana right now. I'm going to be maxing my... Um, W first, and I'll be maxing. And then I'll be maxing my uh, Q after that. They don't really have that much magic damage on their team that, like, wor like I'm worried about them breaking the Black Shield, but we don't want to underestimate what they have anyway. Kane wants to come in. I do have Black Shield. Okay. I don't have my W, but we got... But that flash again. Does she have... I think she does have, um, Cosmic Insight. Uh, we can't really dive here. Let's pop another Dark Harvest pop. I don't have enough mana. But I guess she does want her... He does want his, her stacks. We missed our bind. Yeah, he really wants the stacks. Draven does get 
um, a cash out. We're also denying more minions. We have level 3 on our W. Another Dark Harvest pop. I am out of mana. That bind was not going to land either way. He's playing very defensive here. Is Skarna here? We're going to get our Faded Ashes back in base. We can be a bit more of a nuisance in the lane. Not bad of a start. Five Dark Harvest stacks is really good because we get to harass a lot more. It seems like we're hitting the procs about 30% of their HP, which means that um, we're getting closer to... Well, not more. How am I putting it? We have more opportunities for Draven to get executed. I would cut off my wings if there was steel strong enough. No, your free is more important than a kill. And Nasus, of course, it is. I mean, yeah, I do agree. Like Nasus does need to farm. You don't really need to force with him. Ah, right, you can push that. Drop a ward. We don't see Leon. Oh, there we do. Oh, it's burning. She's level 6, apparently. I had black shield. You don't need to flash. I guess I'm dead here. Huh. That was four bot side. Okay, Katarina's is backing. That's fine. I guess I could just sit around and get experience now. You won't be able to get the objective, right? I don't get a Dark Harvest proc Do here. Very nice. Oh, you went upward. And I missed that. Oh, that's unfortunate. We got Boots, Book. Six Dark Harvest stacks. Game's a little rough. Three deaths top side, three deaths on jungle. Hopefully our Nasus can scale. He does have 79 CS 80. And how many stacks do you have now? 192? You're doing well, aren't you? I should play for Grubs, because we don't want to see Nasus without any Grubs. Nice kill, nice kill. I guess we're not getting it. Shadow is not as dark as one might think. Dean does want help with it. And Leon is not even nearby, so Draven can probably 1v1 this Nila. Fortunately, she has four kills, which is making this game a little harder for us. But. Not all light is a gift. Well, he does have his evolve now. I don't think they see me here. I'm gonna wait for Kane to get closer. Nope. 
Red Cane is not getting a kill. I'm gonna stay away from her as best as I can. Okay. She flashed. Did she ignite? No, she did not ignite me. We get three grubs. Very nice. Good shutdown. Ooh, we're turning this around, guys. Proud of you all. See my freeze in action? Yes, sorry. <laughs> I love that. Whether by chains or by wings, we are all bound. Oh, he can't get the next Q off. Wonder if I can just show up. I was gonna pop here. That's fine. My wings are bound, but my soul flies. Ooh, Draven, Draven, Draven. That was Leona all down. They can't kill him here. Once I had grace, now I have pain. I suffered this for you. I did what I could. Set him up. Battles bring out so many emotions. Skarner can't kill here. He would like to, but he won't. The world is a beautiful place. I'm gonna go back and get my black fire torch. I just dropped all my wards. Imagine she could just travel the base from that. <laughs> just follow the teleport. Nothing makes you feel alive like knowing you might die. Ow. That chain CC hurts. Righteousness. A splintered shield. That I will shut. First turret down. Shut down. Just pop a dark harvest. My shadow outruns my sister. The dark harvest is doing work. We can get this next tower. Get that and then rotate up. Your team has destroyed a turret. He is leaving. There is no control word here. Did he put it deep in our jungle? I want to get sword shoes next. Skarner abandoned the dragon only to go and kill Draven. Where is her control ward? Because she left it in the tri bush. An ally has been slain. Really? Nice dodge. And I am immortal. Pick enough sword shoes so we can deal more damage and break through their defenses. And we'll work on Leandri's next. Our Scorch may be falling off at this point, but at least we're increasing our burns. And the magic damage from the Scorch should be affected by the magic penetration. Do you guys need me? 
I'm just gonna get an assist here. It's another treasure hunter stack anyway. We're at five out of five treasure hunter stacks. Uh, do you think this is wise? Alright, I am definitely not going to stay any longer. But I will ignite Anila. So oh, I'm dead. I missed my bind too, which was a big misplay. I feel like we had so much pressure there, and Arcane was, um... ...in a good advantage of the position in the fight, but... ...me missing my bind there, and the Nilo is also tragic. your six deaths I don't understand why you're talking your has been destroyed. Enemy rampage. only those you love can break your heart you can obviously see how issues are arising An enemy has been nice slain. job Draven I mean My you are soloing them Burn you up a little bit. It has been destroyed. I feel like they still can kill, but they might have reinforcements in a moment. It worked out. Katarina is really t uh, strong too. She has um, eight kills, level eleven. I'm only level eight apparently. I need to get my level nine. Which all, all these fights have been so bad for us. But we're still scaling. Scaling on our burn damage, our team fight should be a lot better. Just missing these binds has been. Painful getting caught on my own. And it's also not great that our Gragas is 0 and 7, too. We are shaped by our foes. You should go and defend mid. We'll lose tier 2. I don't want to go in that direction. I'm giving you black shield in case you want to go in. I am burning the enemies. Nuke the Katarina as she comes in. Get another Dark Harvest pop. Very nice. Ah, uh, we're here for Cloud Drake. We might as well just pick this up. I can go get my next... Um, Faded Ashes in a moment. First, the Baron. I chose my shackles. really trying to like rush this. Alright, cool. We got it.
on my way. Black shield. Oh, he got knocked away from my vine. Uh, Very nice. 14 dark harvest stacks. I'm not gonna throw bind until she stops dashing. Never mind. I was not needed. We can get this tier two. We can probably just run down tier three as well with masses. I'm just gonna put black shield on Nasus when they start approaching. Burn the wave down. Oh, that's not on Nasus. That was on Gragas. I don't want to stay. I'm getting closer to my Leandries, but at least we can pick up these two components. It's just, they're going to be constantly grouping up, so landing my W on an ally already does so much. We just run mid. We don't even help Nasus here. They're going to be wasting a lot of time keep working on him. Burn the wave. Play upward. Nice. That flash is pretty nice. We got their inhibitor. They're just gonna run away. I think we can end, maybe? Oh, I'm still taking the damage because I'm burning somebody on their team. Ow! Draven just wanted to get the uh, kill before we end the game. I don't know if we can end at this point. Ooh. Nice damage, Kane. Nice damage. I think the minions win. Come on, just end the game. Just hit it. There we go. Did you all play it? <laughs> Gragas died eight times, but his best contribution was to get the um, final hit on the Nexus. Uh, I'm going to give it to the Leona. Leona was doing good. Draven was pretty patient in lane. I had fun with that match. I hope you guys did too. It was an A-plus game. Only to 12,000 damage, but the uh, biggest part of this match is getting the Dark Harvest stacks and getting the enemies low so that Draven and our team could get some executes off. 8,000 gold earned. How's our crowd control score? 39 to Leona's 48. I mean, I missed a lot of binds too. 55 vision score to 52. 24 minute game. We would have gotten stronger. I mean, we did just get Leandries as well. And with the Jax, the Skarner, and Leona, we would have done a lot more damage. So we didn't get to get the whole build to work as much as we wanted to. But I had, I had fun with it. If you guys did as well, feel free to drop a like. Look at this. We had 953 damage dealt with Dark Harvest, 16 souls reaped or harvested. We got our five Treasure Hunter stacks. And we were able to get our total uh, bonus... Uh, AP of 30. So if you guys did enjoy, feel free to drop a like, comment if you have any questions, comments, or concerns. Subscribe if you want to see more and more Ghana gameplay. And I'll see you for the next video and or live stream. Live streams are twitch.tv slash supports and see you for the next one. Adios. How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to the next League of Legends video. We're playing some more Morgana support. We're running the Glacial Augment build again. 
Glacial, Magic Footwear, Triple Tonic, Jack of All Trades, Mana Flow, and Transcendence. So scaling build and playing very defensive. We got a brand bot lane. They are right we have brain. three AP champions total on our team with the Heimerdinger mid. We do have our Kane, which looks like he's Minions potentially going Assassin, and a Renekton top. So we have good magical damage to defend our or to like help our team output damage. I, I don't think that place. we're going to be able to I do anything left. before level six because they are the Caitlyn and Karma, and both champions are very strong early game, and we need items for us to do well. So, we're going to be picking up our same build of Blackfire into Zonia's. Just play it slow. I had grace. Try to now scale. I have pain. Negate the first strike gold. Unfortunately, Caitlyn has dodged both abilities. We are taking significant damage already. Alright, there goes her first strike. With every step I Just gotta be careful. Karma barely uses mana whenever she's in lane. Um, her abilities have very low mana costs, but she does have relatively high cooldowns at the beginning of the game. So as long as they're not taking too much damage, we should be okay. Not all light is a Take away that first strike again. All Caitlyn really wants is to generate as much gold as possible. Nice dodge on her part. Just throwing it, just to check out their patterns. You always want to like see where enemies will walk and how they'll dodge. That's why it's not good to always save your abilities, and it's decent that, uh, for you to just put pressure out. So it looks like she dodges left. I'm already at half mana. Karma still has a good amount of her mana. Because uh, Morgana's mana costs are pretty high early game. And her mana pool is pretty low. Nice. Very nice. We took away her first strike once again. Let's keep pushing. We'll put an aggressive ward out in case we see Skarner looking to go over the wall. Looks like they put a defensive ward of their own. What we could do is just put down another... No, maybe we don't even need to at this point. Brand regenerates mana based on how um, much burning is going on for enemies. So we don't really need to always spam. We had them pushed under tower as well. 23 CS to 17. What I could do is try and aim a Q whenever she does land her... Not land, go prep her Q. Because she will have very little time to dodge if I throw it as she casts her Q. We'll see how it works. Taking away first strike again. You got that? Honestly, I thought she was going to juke back, thinking that I was going to lead that shot, but unfortunately, that was not the case. Looking for her first strike to come back up. Nice dodge again. It's really sad not landing these uh, cues at all. Oh, okay. Well, at least we didn't die. Brandis teleport. I think uh, Skarna knew that he could have gone for the gank once our ward died, because it shows debris whenever a ward dies. Brand can collect that. I'm going to just go back and pick up um, items to get my five jack stacks completed. Because I have three different stats from World Atlas, Amplifying Tome, and uh, Ability Power, and Mana. Jack of All Trades is pretty OP on supports, in case you guys weren't aware.
Excuse me. Gotta stay hydrated. Hydration check for all of you. Nice. We get to deny cannon. Now, I don't want to go and play for any objectives unless Kane is showing a lot of confidence because Kane doesn't really have much power before form. We have three scaling champions bot side, and Renekton is pretty weak right now. So, we'll stay here. We'll put pressure out. We are still up in CS right now. I am without um, my flash, so playing defensively is more important at the moment. I'm assuming Karma went topside because I don't see her down here. I'll put some pressure out by just positioning. Heal some damage. Enemy double kill. Yep. It looks like the Gwen is getting a lot of pressure out. I want to go put another ward out and I'll have one in 10 seconds. Very nice farming on your part, Brand. So when you have a CS lead, it's totally fine to not need to stress yourself out and get a lot of uh, damage. You want to play to your ADC's comfort, or APC in this case. And it looks like farming and denying minions is what we're going to do. Nice farming. I'm just going to get that so I can complete my support quest in 9 gold. I want to knock out her first strike once again. There we go. So they put a ward down in the drake pit. I'm going to put one around it as well. Just so we know where Skarner is potentially. I'm just grabbing some fruit so I can get as much HP as possible. And I'll play behind the wall temporarily. So that in case Karma might run up. But I think she knows. She does not know, actually. She's kind of wondering where I am. Do not conflate darkness with evil. Very nice. Take pride in how swiftly we fall. Good work, Brand. Good work. He took a little too much damage. That was very scary. I'm going to be honest. But we will kill this wave. Push it in. I don't really care if I do get the last hits or not. But we get to deny so many minions on this, uh, Caitlyn. I can't get any more support charges here. Because I don't have anybody next to me. Ooh, do we want to go for the dragon now? They might have thought I backed. Very nice. I'm just going to use my uh, potion now. Huge. Okay, well, I guess we're not going to go for this now. Kane died to Karma. Bit of a support game, huh? I have so much gold on me, I need to back. But I'll stay until Brand leaves. Can we leave? Mm, this wave needs to go under. I did not mean to take all of those. Oh, I do have my Blackfire Torch completed. Nice. So I can feel each fracture of the earth. 
Uh, I don't know if I want to go and contest Grubs again. I feel like we're about to lose. Yeah, we're just losing Renekton. It's not worth it. Betrayal never comes from your enemies. We just keep playing bot side. We're gonna hit level nine and get our next triple tonic potion as well. Well, obviously not next level, but soon. My broken heart still beats. We need to pick up um, our magic resist shoes. Our I can't remember the name. Mercury's Treads. Merc Treads. Know me by my pain. Ow. There is no control ward. We can just keep pushing a brand. I don't want to go and gank and chase because Kane has more movement speed. It looks like they handled it anyway. I'm gonna block that. I think Caitlyn might be dead. Fear this. This will be cool. Pain must be felt. I was trying to give the kill. I couldn't dodge that. That was so sloppy. I was trying to give the kill to Brand, but that was greedy. Alright, well we got our Merc Treads. Now we just need 90 gold until our armor, and then we get our 10 Jack Stacks. So additional ability uh, power. That Karma had a Mantra W, which is why um, she did live there. So quite unfortunate. We're losing out on the objective, but we are keeping this Caitlyn down, which is important. Minions came up. My wings are bound, but my soul flies. You don't need to all caps that, buddy. But I'm here. I'm here. Okay, Karma. Quite painful. We're gonna get our Zazox since we completed our ward quest. She doesn't lose her first strike yet. Now she does. Burn her up. We got a double kill. Good work. I think we just get this tower because they keep playing topside and killing our uh, Renekton. Now we have our triple tonic potion completed. That leads us to 10 jack stacks, getting closer to our Seeker's Arm Guard. I prefer an honest sinner over a righteous liar. Uh. 
this is really, really bad. There's just so much like aid, like damage coming out towards us, and we're not able to fly anything because we don't have our summoners. Not summoners, uh, ultimates. Caitlyn's desperate. Brandon and I did not have ultimates there. At least we're ahead of this karma. That's that's the most important thing right now. For me, at least. Because, I mean, I can't really control the rest of the game, especially with how topside has gone. But at least I can say that we're doing our job and hopefully our scaling is going to matter. I'm just going to take the control ward and be imposing, act like I have uh, pressure, even though I don't. Because we need to exude confidence despite the fact that we're behind. Especially since we have a lot of crowd control on our team. We can kind of fight this Gwen, but she is two items. She just doesn't have any magic resist. So I'm going to prep my exhaust for her. Does she know? Shadow is not as dark as one might think. I guess she may have saw me. I guess she may have seen me through because of minions. Oh. I just missed two binds. I need to leave. <laughs> I'm embarrassed. I missed two binds there. I just want to put my pool down. Oh, I got the shut down. That's not good. That's a lot of gold for me to take. But, I'm happy that she's dead at least. So that we can get our dragon. This feels good. I'm very proud of myself. Five and two. We have Ocean Drake. Uh, Brand is backing. I'll back as well. Because we're not going to go uh, mid lane right now. I can't pick up a large rod yet, but I did want my seekers first, just in case. I have seen liars choose How much damage are you do so far? Seven hundred and twelve. That's not bad. Perhaps today I will see a it's actually more than I typically do around this time. We want to stick together with our brand because we do have a mark on us from Akshan. We'll put a middle lane ward. Or River Ward. I know what my enemies feel. They so that we can to control topside. I couldn't uh, walk out of that in time, so I figured I hit that. I did not fall from grace. I oh. I guess you're not letting me get over here. I want to kill this Skarner before they kill my Heimerdinger, because we do need him for defense. Heimer can push bot, but we need to show ourselves mid, stop this Gwen push. And we can do that easily, because Brandon and I have amazing wave clear. see anything and I do want to keep a ward on Baron I don't want to put that elsewhere I 
I could refresh my vision too. I don't want to black shield myself. Very nice, good work. Unfortunately, I'm not over near Renekton, and I want to take advantage of any pressure that we have to take out their mid tower. Uh, walk towards me. I'm gonna exhaust her so she doesn't heal as much. My wings are heavy. You're still but not as heavy as two legged goat. We have triple burn on this team, so I do need to put a ward down across the wall. Oh, you're just dead. Okay. Why didn't you put down your turret before to defend us? I mortal cycles begin anew. I'm not really upset. It's just a little frustrating, you know? But it is what it is. At least we are still putting out a lot of pressure. It's just that we need to make sure that we, we keep in mind bound. that there's more than Gwen. Akshan's three items. Are we worried about him? Do I need to build defensively against him, or do I? Can I just keep building burn? I find beauty in these shadows. I could I could build locket. Mitigate their burst. Darkness is everywhere. Uh, Kane? That's a bit much. Although, it's a little weird that the three of, like, three people are in top jungle. But, Baron's the only objective up. You just want to play for, um, oh. I gotta land my binds, aiming them weirdly. Ooh, well played. There is multiple topside. We should be able to kill the Gwen. A lot of their damage is on their Akshan, so. To be bound. My pain Goodbye, Gwen. Your team has destroyed a turret. Balance. Balance. We 
are the sum of our mistakes. I don't think they can take our Baron. Or not our, but Baron in general. Do I at least want to walk around and provide a black shield just in case? I feel like I get one shot by Akshan here. But I do have my Zonias. Yep, there he is. What's your torment? Some pray to fate. I forge my own path. And as Cyril does. I can even like heal in the next fight, but I need to back. Alright, so what did I want? Lock it? Get a little tank here. And help my team out against their burst. My the anti burst item. Especially since our income has kind of declined. We got a lot of kills early on, but that doesn't mean that we're going to continue getting kills. My shadow outruns my sister's light. We don't see many people topside, it was just Akshan. Redectin's backing. I'm just trying to, like, keep the crowd control going. Looks like Brand's dealing a lot of damage with his ultimate. He is getting a lot out. Unfortunately, Gwen and Caitlyn have been revived due to Akshan. Oh, that is unfortunate. Ooh, flash from Skarner. I wonder if he's able to get out here. Ah, the sweet smell of science. Nope. Akshan has basically ruined this game I have endured worse. for us. I have no idea if I could even stop this, but... I'll go and position myself. Do not conflate darkness nope. With evil. Doesn't matter. Renekton's going to be top again. I feel like we can fight this. I just don't have Zonias. Black Shield's up in 10. He's dead again. I'm not surprised. Oh wait, that's our Renekton that I just threw my bind at. I uh, all right, we just give this. The fact that Caitlyn's pushing this on her own is not the best. Oh my god, she hurts. Ow. She has three items. Lock is compl uh, not complete. Darn it. I was going to say, I, almost, I have it done now, but I don't. Oh, close though. I'll just keep burning enemies. It's just one inhibitor down. So we do have a potential to come back here. The 
Betrayal never comes from your they don't really have much magic resist on their team either. It's just damage. So if you can build a little bit more health and just survive through burning the enemies and well having more HP, we should be good. My broken heart still beats. I prove them right. Do you beat the uh Nakshan here or are you just dead? Oh, their whole team's here. An ally has been slain. My chosen shot. I'm gonna go defend top, I think. Home. Get my locket and defend Never top. Wow, Gwen's actually beating up my team. An enemy has been slain. I shall show them what it is to fall. You just don't want to lose top tower as well. So I gotta remember to like actually use my active items. She dodged that. Once again, Brand and I do have good wave clear, and our bot wave is actually all the way down there, so they're not able to push. Brand almost died. Just continuing to clear. Our pressure is so bad. I have truths of my own. Especially with having an invis champ, such as Akshan, it makes it harder to develop pressure because you're afraid of getting picked. So sticking together is usually the plan. Are you all in the jungle watching Keen? I mean, I was putting vision down. My sister caught a right. I didn't get my ult off. I was hesitating on that one. Oh, painful game. But it was a game. I mean, we did have a decent start. It was just everyone was getting picked off by this Akshan and we didn't have enough vision. I'll give it to the Akshan. He played well. Yeah, unfortunately, it's motion, but I still feel like this is a good game that I played. 11,000 gold earned, 15k damage dealt. That was my cow control. 56, 83 vision score to Karma's 96. She had more pressure out. Um, we did reduce 1300 damage. I think I'll get a game two going because I do. I did like 
playing this match. So we're going to work on that in a moment. But if you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to drop a like. And I'll get see you in the next game two. Adios.